Hi you guys, this video is about the solar eclipse that the United States will be experiencing this Monday, August 21st, 2017. And it's the first time since 1979 that the United States will experience a total eclipse. Um, this video is to inform you of the proper eyewear um, lens that you would need for your camera and iPhone if you're planning on watching the solar eclipse. So first of all, please do not look at the solar eclipse with the naked eye. That will cause permanent eye damage or even blindness. So please purchase the proper eyewear to watch the solar eclipse. And I'll put the link in my this video description where you can order the proper eyewear. Also, if you're gonna use your iPhone, please get a telephoto lens. The telephoto lens will help you get better up close images as if you're using a magnifying glass. Um, you can totally use your cell phone without the telephoto lens. Um, it will give you a long view, nothing up close, but um, you'll still, I'm sure, get some good pictures, but not the same as you would if you were um, using a telephoto lens, which is similar to like a magnifying glass. Also, um, very important, we all know how much our camera costs. So please do not attempt to take pictures or film the, the solar eclipse with your camera without the proper lens. I will have the description to a good lens that you can purchase to protect your camera. Um, and this is because our camera has sensors in them and those sensors were not designed for viewing the sun's rays for a long period of time. So there's lens designed specifically for viewing the sun's rays um, for any length of time. So please protect your cameras as well and purchase the lens, the proper lens for your camera. Also, there's a really cool site I want to let you guys know about. Okay, you guys, this is the site timeanddate.com. Once you're on this site, just click this interactive map right here and then make it larger. Okay, this dark pink area that you see, this is the totality path. The eclipse is going to be moving from the west to the east and this dark pink area shows the areas that will experience a total eclipse. If you're living in these areas or you're gonna be visiting this area, you will get to see a total eclipse, meaning you will get to see when the moon completely covers the sun and experience complete darkness. If you live in these areas, you see how it becomes lighter pink and lighter and lighter and lighter. These areas will experience a partial eclipse. And if you look at the graph here, it will tell you what percentage of the sun will be covered in the areas that you live in. So for example, if I go up to this search box and type in Austin, Texas, it will show me how much of the sun will be covered in Austin, Texas. So basically this is the information here. The eclipse will be in Austin, Texas for two hours and 58 minutes. It, starting, it starts at 11.41 and it ends at 2.39. Um, Austin will experience the maximum sun coverage at 1.10 p.m. on Monday. So you can kind of play with the search box up here if there's an area that you would like to know how much coverage or how much of the eclipse you will experience you can type in a city and state to find out where and when you will experience this solar eclipse so that's it for this video guys please give me a thumbs up like and share if this video was helpful to you and i'll see you guys in the next video